Hey guys and welcome back to our channel. My name is Bibi and I have two miniature American Shepherds named Maui and Koa. And on this channel we talk all things dogs and mini Aussies. So if you like that then please subscribe to our channel and let's get into the video. So, it's currently Thursday, September 5th, I think. We're going on vacation tomorrow really early, so I think around 6 or 7. We're going to Corsica for two weeks, so we leave tomorrow morning Friday and we will be coming back on a Saturday the 21st. And I really wanted to show you what I packed for the dogs for this trip. Unfortunately, this little lady here... Oh, this little lady, she got into heat a little bit early, so she was not supposed to be in heat until the end of September. Um, but yeah, she's been in heat since August 31st and we have two intact males coming on this trip with us. So Koa, who's intact, and my mom's dog Snow, who's also intact. So unfortunately this meant that she cannot come on the trip which honestly i have cried about a lot and i will cry tonight and tomorrow morning a lot probably luckily ko is coming with so that means i am a little bit distracted but yeah i will cry i'm really sad about it um but luckily she is staying with my twin sister who i trust 100% so I am really happy that my sister is looking after her and she will get some one-on-one -on -one time with her so yeah really thankful for that so only Koa is coming which means I'm only packing for Koa and then I'm also packing for Maui uh, to stay at my sister's place I am going to show you what I'm packing for Koa so we're going by car we have about a 12 hour drive then we are taking the a boat to from Savona to the island of Corsica and then we have I think about a two hour drive after that. We will arrive on Saturday. And the only thing I need to mention is that they're missing a couple things that are already at my parents place. So we have his swimming vest, some extra towels, beach towels and they are in the back seat with me and we have bought like this dog thing to keep the seats clean. So that's already at my parents place as well. This is the car organizer I'm bringing. So I have one for Koa, or I had them for Koa and Maui, but this is all Koa's things. And then I have one for myself, which they can stack on top of each other. So yeah, the first thing is I have this blanket. I bought it at Crufts and it's this beautiful blanket. So this is his pillow. This is the to put on top. Okay. So we have some outside pockets. So I will, I don't know if you can see that. We have outside pockets and then we have three inside pockets. One is for food, for toys, things and leashes. Okay, so we'll start with food. We have a treat bag with all kinds of treats. So we have like ears and chicken paws, etc. Just put them to chew on. Then we have his kibble, a three kilo bag, which is enough for the two weeks. We have two water bottles, which for one of his harnesses, so he can carry a little bit of his own water. So we have those. We have a, like a cup measurement for his kibble. Then we have a couple supplements. So we have fast feed, which I think is great, especially if it, there are hot temperatures for, to project his paws. And then we have green lipped muscle, which these are both from the brand Fast Dog. And then I have a small thing of salmon oil, which I got at Crufts. Then I have one bowl. So I have just this one from Soda Cup because it's really small and I think it's easy to use. We have a collapsible water bowl 
for when we go on hikes and day trips just to give them water. I have one little bag of steamed meat. We can add to that kibble. And then we have six, you know, meat things. These are also for my mom's dog snow. So we'll we be using these. So we have, I think, three flavors. So we have two of the fresh chicken with wild berries. And then we have two fresh lamb with wild berries. And then we have fresh, fresh wild boar with wild berries. So we have six of these. And then the last thing in this big pocket is, or the second to last, is some pee pads. I'm only bringing this because we're traveling by boat for so like eight hours. So I just don't know the situation and I'm just keeping these at hand. And then I have this thing to do it like this. And so we can put it in the fridge without any like mass. Oh yeah, and the last thing is I have Co Coas rabies certificate. So his, when we took blood for the sample, I just keep it here. I uh, We will not need it, but I'm just keeping it. So yeah, that's the big pocket for food. Okay, so then we have two side pockets here. We have these straps for in the car. And then I have some, maybe if we need it, probably not, but scissor, a comb, and nail clipper, and some shampoo if necessary for Koa. So then we have some side pockets. I have an extra collar and an extra uh, tag as well. And then I have some doggy socks. And then on this side, I have poop bags. I have the Gentle Leader from the brand Black Dog. I have his shoes in case we need it. We have some muzzle. We have a muzzle because in some countries it is needed. So yeah, those are the things on the side. And then we have two pockets. I have an emergency kit. I made this emergency kit after Koa had his accident and I, you know, we needed things that we did not have at the time, which means I made this. So this is coming with us. It's probably going to stay in the car. Okay. So then we have a couple toys. So we have a, a chuck it stick. We have a floaty for in the water. We have the, these two from... They're from the brand Agility Toy, which I am, which I'm currently working with them. I'm their ambassador, so I just want to maybe take some photos with these. So we have this one with a chuck it ball, and we have this bungee. So I'm bringing those, and then I also think I have a tennis ball in here somewhere. Harnesses. We have just a normal harness, which he will have on in the car. We have the Roughwear uh, switchback harness, which has little pockets, um, which these bottles that I got fit in. So these are for, you know, hikes, etc. So these fit. I just got these, so it's the first time, you know, using them. And then I have a little light on here. Um, so yeah, the switchback harness. Then I also have the Approach backpack, um, which is for a little bit of longer hikes. So they have a larger pocket and then a small pocket. These are also really great for larger water bottles and like his shoes, etc. So we have those. And then I have two cooler vest from Wolfwear. So we have the orange one, which I thought if he's wearing this one, we are pairing it with the orange cooler vest. And then the blue version to pair with this one and his normal or his normal harness. I bought the orange one for Maui, but she actually needed a smaller size. So now I just have these two. So I'm using it for Koa. Then we have one Pompa Jumpa, a you know, sweater. We have his bed robe, which is the from the brand Dry Up, which I'm really happy with. And then we have his raincoat, which is the 
pompa kvir. Then we have leashes and then two extra things. So we have a paw cleaner and we have a pin for the ground leashes. We have a normal leash. We have a slip leash, a small grab handle. We have this one, which is really handy for hikes. It's a hands-free leash, which I usually pair with his harnesses, etc. And then we have the flexi leash, also great for hiking when he cannot be off leash. And then I have the GoPro harness. Maybe we can get some fun footage. And then we have a 10 meter line, uh, which I bought when we were in Denmark, when uh, they were not allowed off leash on the beach. And we bought these, so I'm bringing that. And I'm bringing these longer lines. I forgot to mention in the video that I'm also bringing his dog passport. So in Europe we have the EU passport with like the vaccinations, various vaccinations, etc. So I'm bringing that. But it was with my passport, that's why I forgot. And two other things clips, really handy to have to connect the lines. And because we are camping, a light or walking in the dark so yeah i forgot those things and i've been using them a lot that's everything i'm bringing for goa on our two-week trip i'm also making a separate video on what i'm bringing for maui to my sister's place so yeah definitely look out for that video as well and then our next videos will be vlogs of our trip to Corsica. So if you want to see our journey traveling by boat and by car to the island of Corsica, then please subscribe to our channel and like this video if you found it helpful. And I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.